Looking for a way to get healthy? The Chef You and I program has the answer. Catherine Raker and chefs from around the nation will teach even the most inexperienced how to cook. Come into their kitchen and watch them take ordinary foods with loads of calories and fat and turn those foods into healthier dishes. You will be the first to get tips and ideas on foods that are easy to prepare. Now let's join Catherine and today's chef and learn how to make today's recipes. Hi, this is Catherine Raker of The Chef You and I, and we are at the McCormick Center at the International Houseware Show, and we are with Sheila Dietrich of Live Liga, um, which is a wonderful new program of, of cutlery, cutlery? Cutlery? Well, it's really dinnerware and dinner tableware. And tableware. Mm -hmm. And books. And books. I love this. Exactly. You know, I have on our show, Sheila, we have children chefs that come oh, on. which I think is fantastic to get kids involved at oh, an early age. Actually, it gets my, them a passion that they can really love and be a part of and learn and right. then share. Children love sharing. Right. So if we teach our kids, they actually teach then others and adults to live healthy. Well, you know what's really funny is my granddaughter started, and I told you this on the phone. Yes. My granddaughter started cooking at age two and a half Amazing. in this little apartment that she had in in wonderful California. Uh -huh. And um, she the first thing that she wanted to learn how to make was chicken soup. Chicken soup, well actually chicken soup for the soul is a really good thing, right? So she's a smart kid, smart I got a kid. feeling. Well now she's almost seven and she takes over whenever we do anything in the kitchen. Oh, fun. That's the reason why I love your line of children's beautiful wear. Now can I pick it up? Absolutely, please do. And um, the plate is a fun thing to oh, start with wow. because what we call, it, oops, something's on there. It's visually intuitive right. so you can see see how sammy this is sammy and her brother sax and their dog rhubarb oh, and they go that. on adventures together wow. and sammy has on her t-shirt which you also will see on the pages on of the book that her t-shirt always has different vegetables and different images on it so it's kind of like a where's waldo so kids are learning about vegetables and different types of food right. Right. that are all healthy for them so sammy has broccoli here and that tells you that's where the broccoli or the fruit or vegetable goes right. that's a cup that's what a cup looks like so so it's about proportion and it's about different types of food for a balanced meal and it's about how much because so much of us all of us really don't know what a serving size is for the different food groups so we're kind of sneaking this is for sauces and condiments people always say you know what's the beehive doing there that's for the honey and this of course the the chicken is to remind us that's where the protein goes right. on the back we always have a map Oh, like and so that. the map shows us what the different food groups are and the different serving sizes. And kids actually have different serving sizes than adults. And we often think that kids are small, so they should maybe have more rather than less because they're burning up so much energy and they're so, but it's actually the opposite. They don't burn as much as we do because they're littler. And so for instance, this is just a half cup, whereas the adults have a half cup and a three-fourths cup and their protein is less. We often think that we should have more protein, but actually we need protein, but we just don't need as much as we think we do. So this for kiddos is about two to four ounces. So, you know, Sheila, I love the way you have designed this and how long did it take you to design it? So we incorporated in 2011 and it took me a couple of years of research and development because I actually read a lot of the research on um, behavioral economics, which is kind of the, our behavior around food. And so... Um, Are you a nutritionist? Well, I actually was most recently the executive director of the American Heart Association oh, wow. in Denver. Wow. And it's really there that I um, became aware that not only was it a challenge that I had in terms of food and weight, but that it's really an epidemic and that we're still struggling to find the solutions. Um, when you have very large health organizations like the American Heart Association spending multi-millions of dollars and the statistics are still going in the wrong direction, I thought there's something missing here. And that's when I did the research and discovered it's our eyes that make all the decisions about the food we eat, not our stomachs. Right. And you know what I want to what I want to say is that most people that are trying to lose weight should be using this plate. Uh, well, actually they can use this, this plate. This one? Because really it. there's just a little bit of difference. Okay. And this is sort of our visually intuitive uh, design. So this is our celebrate line. We have three adult lines. Um, and this is the celebrate and it deals with the next layer of psychology. Since we've embedded psychology in all the dishware, we have three patents because we are so unique. 
Um, and this has words. You know how words have such a profound effect yes, on us? they do. And they can really, they can make us feel really bad or they can make us feel really good. We're all about the really good because when we feel better, we take a deep breath, we feel more in control. And when we're more in control, we make better decisions about the food we eat, right? I know I work with the American Heart Association all the time. Oh, because good. Because our, actually, our television show, The Chef You and I, came to being because we wanted to fight obesity here in the United States. Right on, this is a good mission. And so we are a healthy cooking show and yes. we teach people how to yes. cook, yes. and children to cook. I like the style. I like the thing on the way you designed everything. And you know what I love about your children's program is yes. that you actually give them glass and you actually give them a cup and a bowl. And you know, Cassie would absolutely love not only the set, but the book, because guess what? what? Being six and a half years old and in the first grade, we're reading together uh -huh. as well. And is this that... book is designed to read together. That's and important. Yeah, I'm very proud to say it won the Moonbeam Children's Book Award for health issues. Wow, this is so great. We're very proud of it. And, and of course, it happens in the magical land of quinoa. Did you know that there was a magical land called quinoa? Who knew? I love quinoa. Uh, it's a really yummy it grain. Is and wonderful. it's a fun way to introduce because quinoa is one of those grains that absorbs the flavors of whatever you put in it. So it's a very versatile grain. And so kids can really experiment with it and their favorite flavors become the flavor of the quinoa. So they can really embrace and love uh, a, a grain that might be something they're going, hmm, grain? Do I really want that? Mm. <laughs> So it's a good one to introduce kiddos well, to. Well, you know, um, this line is absolutely beautiful. Now you have different designs. Yes, you we do. You have the beautiful design for children. Yes. And what do you call this one? And it comes one? in pink Celebrate. too, by the oh, way. Does? See the pink over there? Oh, that's beautiful. So depending on um, the kid and depending on the colors, mm -hmm. that may be a better choice. Right. And we have um, blue. We have one line called Halsa that's mm -hmm. all in hues of blue because blue has been proven to be an appetite suppressing color. That's true, and yeah. what I love about blue is, is that it is also a relaxing color. Yes, it is. And so when you're calming. eating, when you're eating calming, when you're eating, you should be eating slower. Yes. Correct. Yes. And Chewing, so you really are aware of the flavors. 25 times, right? Well, yes, or at least more than we do. Yeah, no. more than we do. <laughs> but you know what I love? What is this? This is a live spoon, and they come in four different sizes, right? And they map to the plate, so you can hook that spoon. Okay. So you're actually hooking this on onto a bowl, a bowl mm -hmm. or a we pan, can kind of maybe? experiment a, pan? a pot or pot? a pan. This is a big one, okay. but right. so we can hook it on the side here, which may be a little oh, easier I to love show. That. Oh. And so you can hook the right size with the right type of food. So right. this is um, a three-fourths cup, which might be for your grain, depending right. on what you're right. serving up for your spaghetti right. or something. Mm -hmm. And then once you've used it, if it's saucy and has uh, liquids, you can hook it upside down oh, so that, that. Um, what is left in the spoon will drip back in the bowl so you can serve fresh each time since we want every bite to count. Now let me ask this question. Yes. How long did it take you to design all of this and they're all available now. Can we buy these now? Yes, you can. You can everything you see. You can buy. We are just launching a new set right. that's going to be um, that you'll see next year here to be a snack set mm. because every time we eat, we actually eat more snacks than we do our regular meals, and right. so we're, that's one of our problems is we're overeating because we're eating them like the sizes of a meal rather than the size of a snack. Now so we I, do have a special snack set. Now what I do is I eat five or six times a day. Yes, which is not a, it's a good thing to do. I'm a hyper a, a hypoglycemic. Oh. And so we have to eat that way. Yes. Because if we don't, our blood sugar goes down, and then right? You get cranky, right? I get very cranky. <laughs> it get weird, actually. That's what and you probably don't feel me. very well. No, so no, it's no, good no, you're no, eating no. six times a day. No. So I would love to feature this on my television show, on my cooking show, because it's so oh, thank beautiful. You. Thank I you, love thank the you. colors that you picked. Can we be serious for a moment? Yeah, go right ahead. The one thing we really need to talk about is the oh, wine glass. I love that. So, because a lot of people are very possessive about their wine. I am. Mm-hmm. But the wonderful thing is the way we've designed everything, we've designed it so the visual illusion makes it look like a lot. Because right. in the supersized world we live in, right-sized amounts of food or drink right. can look puny. Right. And so in this, see how the stem is shorter 
compared to the bowl of the um, wow. of the glass. So it makes that look like a whole lot. So when you have a line for four ounces or six ounces, if you fill it up to that, it actually looks like a lot. That does look like and a so lot. And so you're gonna feel satisfied when you drink it because you're gonna feel like you got what you deserved. And I love what you did on this. That's Isn't that beautiful? beautiful. That's called our Avec design. And I so love our serveware that. and our accessories are all designed in the Avec oh, design. Oh, I love this. Sheila, you've done such a great job. Oh, you're but so you, nice, you have thank a you. Partner? I do. Oh, I have a husband, fortunately, a who's also a life partner in all kinds of things. Oh, that's He gets good. into trouble with me with business and all sorts of adventures. Well, you know, it seems like that more and more couples like us, yes. because my husband's my partner in film yes. and television, that, you know, you work together and you cry together, you, you laugh <laughs> inspire together, together, inspire together, yes. and create together. Yes. So anyhow, now, is there anything else? Oh, how much does this cost? Can you buy the whole set? Yes, so we have, we basically do everything in sets of four. Okay. So a four piece place setting like this, right. or like those, right. um, is $49.95 retail. Wow, that's and it's really cost effective. And it's artist designed, so yes. we're very proud of that. Mm -hmm. um, and of course it has a lot of science packed into it, so right. you get a lot. Um, right. And then these are also the glassware are sold in sets of four. The wine glasses are forty nine ninety five. Right. The beverage glass is forty four ninety five. Oh, and I love the beverage glasses. Can I show the beverage oh, glasses? Oh, please do. Oh, this is gorgeous. You know, I like the design on this because it is number one. It feels good in my hand and doesn't feel like I'm going to drop Women it. Women love it. Oh, I love it. And they give these and the wine glasses as gifts because they, right. you know, they love the fact that it, it's. It really is styled to feel comfortable. Right. It's chic, right. um, and it's also very useful. So there's a little bit of a smile when they give it as a gift. Okay, here's the deal. I'd like to have you on my cooking show, oh, and I'd wonderful. like to invite you to bring some of your dishes and do your cooking show with me. And we can also do a piece oh, on wouldn't that be fun your to wonderful do a book. Cooking. And yes. I do audio books, just to let you know. Oh. Yes, <laughs> children's audio books, and I love, I love this book. It's oh, so beautiful. You. Do you have any recipes in here, by yes, the way? Yes, we do, in the Can back of it. Can you show me it. where it oh, is? Oh, I would love to, because right. they're, um, after they do their adventure, because it's all about being in the land of quinoa, and everybody's a puzzle piece, and mm -hmm, so what they finally mm -hmm. learned at the end of the book is that when the puzzle pieces come together, that's the winning combination, which is a balanced meal. And so then they have to go back home and yeah. design their own balanced meal, which we'll turn around here. Okay, show that. And so this is the balanced meal, which uh -huh. is a turkey burger, baked sweet potato fries. Ooh, I love those. Grilled broccoli, and of course the ketchup that all children seem to need and love. And so that those that's recipes. It is, well, <laughs> according to the U.S. government, but not yes, necessarily all not the rest of us. <laughs> but that's actually, actually. But it does have right. tomato in it. Tomato, um, which is a fruit, actually. Yeah. Not so a, there you go, right. is all the different recipes wow. that of that that meal that they design wow. and then um, right. their activities and follow up that people can right. do to continue the conversation about balanced meal, about right. good food, about cooking, about enjoying doing it together. We're going to do your website. What is that? Oh, it is LaVigaHome.com. LaVigaHome.com. That's it. And what I'd love to do is feature your recipes. Wouldn't that be fun? Cooking show. Oh, I would love to do that. So, that would be so fun. Let's do that. Okay. Okay. All right. And we want to say thank you for bringing me into your La Viga oh, you world. You are most welcome. It's wonderful. Thank all of you for coming to visit, too. Thank you so much. You bet. Thanks for coming by. And we'll be right back on The Chef, you and I, after these important messages. Thanks for joining us on the Chef You and I show today. We'll be back next week with another great and healthy recipe. Don't forget to visit our website, thechefyouandi.com, for all of our featured recipes, cooking tips, and clips of the show.